Hey ass, how's your day been so far? <laughs> Let me just really quickly remove the follower because, I mean, not remove it. They did the thing where they just followed and unfollowed so the name pops up, but uh, yeah, it looks like they didn't actually stick around and we ain't doing that shit today. There we go. Hey. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> Jesus, how awkward would it be if they actually did stay in my thing, just didn't update, so I just removed the name. Yikes. But hi, I hope your morning's been good. Um, <coughs> uh, so what some people like to do is they like to follow someone just so the name um pops up, and then they unfollow. And with my stream managers, none of them updated. So that's how I know they just followed and unfollowed. So I just went into my stream elements to um, clean up the overlay so that the name doesn't pop up. Because uh, that's what someone did for the uh, Olympian stream. They followed right at the beginning and just didn't say. <laughs> Wait, so, so you do sleep. Okay, because... <laughs> You've been coming to my stream every day so far, but then it's also like, I still think you're a night person. It's just like, how long do you sleep for? Because I need a lot of sleep. No, um, surprisingly, they stayed followed. It was the person before them that, um, had unfollowed. Uh, you, you tend to see it usually at the beginning of streams. That way it's just like, oh, they're not gonna undo it. People who follow towards the end of the stream usually want to be in the stream but didn't want like a huge shout out thing it's psychology is pretty interesting and i'm so glad it works in this <laughs> but yeah um about the whole streaming everyday thing it's only going to be uh you stay up until 3 a.m oh God, I could not do that. I mean, I, I can, but like, I would hate myself in the morning. <laughs> but yeah, um, about streaming every day for the whole week, I just... So, <laughs> I've talked about this before. I'm someone who listens to like signs and like terror readings and like messages and stuff. And a lot of them have told me to stay home. They didn't say how long I had to stay home for, just that I needed to let other people do what they needed without me interfering. So I decided, hey, I might as well try out Twitch, see if I can actually do a whole week. Um, it's not going to be the actual week though, it's just going to be Monday to Friday. So, two more days after this, and then we're back to one and a half streams a week, because fuck. Although I can do this. I, I run out of things to say because I haven't, you know, really done anything with people yet. That's also why I like streaming only like one and a half times a week, just because I, I actually can go out, make stories, and tell you guys them. <laughs> mm, but speaking of stories and stuff, not a fun one, but a lecture. Remind me either when Ghost is in chat or towards the end of the stream, because I just want to talk about how... You shouldn't be following me because of another creator, because I I don't need that in my life. Um, I'll definitely say it towards the end of the stream just so that I can like highlight and put it on stream later. But I really I want to give Ghost a chance to actually potentially defend themselves. Uh, that sounds bad. I don't know. It's just I feel like they're really only here because of Vay and Sticks. So it's just they're treating my chat and me as if I'm Sticks, and I don't take the same bullshit Six does. Like, 
Like, in the nicest way possible. Six knows uh, my concerns with them. They're, they're a little bit of a pushover. Yeah, I'm not I'm not taking Ghost of Shit if they really do want to stay for me. Um, are you talking about what happened yesterday? No, here's the thing. They actually do that a lot. It's not just yesterday. It's in um, different streams on servers. They just act like a little child. And if you don't apologize to them, they get upset even though they're wrong. So it's just... <laughs> You know what, I might as well just say it now, and then just if they join, I tell them to watch the beginning of the stream. <sighs> I do appreciate people like you guys, who like, you see me in chat, you think I'm cool or something, and we start talking. That, I appreciate. Same with Paula. Paula saw me in Clearstar Gaming's chat, we started talking. Yay. Ghost. We don't talk. Outside of streams. We don't talk outside of chat. <sighs> So them following me on stream feels more like, oh, because I know Sticks and Faye, they probably just followed me because, you know, that mentality. But this is not early 2000s YouTube. You don't have to follow your favorite creators, friends, and business partners because that mentality is horrible. <laughs> because, um, say someone is family friendly and they have a friend who clearly isn't. On the family friendly channel, obviously everyone's gonna act family friendly. So followers are like, oh, this guy's kinda cool, let's go follow them. And then you get to their channel, and I'm talking about suicide and death all the time. It's just, you shouldn't be. <sighs> you know, it's like, yeah, thank you for thinking I'm cool, but please only follow me if you actually like my content and not how I act on someone else's stream. Because that's their etiquette, not mine. I actually wrote a few things down because I knew I might forget about it because, um, <laughs> I don't know. Granted that I only have 22 followers, I don't want to start off with people who are here for other people because that's just the shittiest way to start. Yeah, it's like, remember, I am not them. If you follow someone who's family friendly and expect like family friendly content, don't come to my stream, please. And if, and in the case of Stick, you know how Stick will apologize. They apologize for things that they didn't even do and things that they're clearly right to do. And it's just, no, you're not going to get that shit from me. If you do something wrong, I'm not going to say you're in the right or that it's okay. I'm going to call you out on it. And it's just like, with that being said, when people... I don't want to call Gabby out, but me and Gabby have talked this over. Um, this is something I actually talked to Gabby about. She is fine knowing that they did what I need to learn pronouns. I do apologize. They they are fine with what they did. They acknowledge like it's a thing. Um, so Gabby tends to treat me a lot more casually than they would treat Styx. In the sense that Styx and I both have rules against uh, certain things, but when it comes to Talking about those things, Gabby's a lot more comfortable talking about them with me than Six. And sometimes that comfortability goes into pushing the line and breaking a certain rule. Um, which is not it either. Just because I'm not your streamer and I'm more aggressive or darker or political doesn't mean you can do those things in my chat. Like, if I'm being, if like you join an activist chat, that doesn't mean you can say conservative thoughts. If you join someone who is LGBT, that doesn't mean you can be homophobic. Just because your other streamer absolutely does not want it and the other streamer does touch on those topics, doesn't mean you should. It's just, um, you know... It's, it's, it's my platform, you know? Not theirs, and I really hate people who think just because they're in chat, like, they're boosting the viewers, they're keeping me engaged, that they deserve entitlement, that's a horrible mentality. And maybe, maybe that's just the way ghosts act in real life. But to me, that feels like they want more. And I'm not giving them more. If they're gonna complain and be like, oh, I guess this is my cue because I'm being kicked out of the stream. Yeah, leave. 
If you think I'm being harsh, then I'm harsh. I'm not going to reassure you that you should stay because no one should tell you you have to stay in the stream. And they've done other things like on Discord servers that don't settle right with me. And it's just own up to your actions. Don't try to brush it under the carpet because now you're uncomfortable because you made everyone else uncomfortable. So yeah, um, definitely remind me to highlight this part later just because I'd rather people not follow me than follow me because I know people. That doesn't make sense. But I... <laughs> Because again, um, if you are following me for much, for example, um, you don't have to be here. You don't have to come every day if you don't want to. But I don't think you're here because of much. Just we've actually talked outside of the servers and stuff, and you seem really chill. And your life is kind of crazy. Yeah, I want people to follow me for myself and not because of my friends, which is kind of funny because uh, I I checked chat earlier. Faye, I know you're here. Um. I don't really know what I am with you, and with Six, Six knows that I only see them as a business partner. So like, I'm not even friends with these people, and yeah, I'm getting their followers joining my stream because of them. Because like, Ghost and I don't talk outside of chat, and in chat, we're always arguing about something. So it's just like, you're not here for me. You're not. Or at least I don't feel like you are. Because yeah. I might have a more aggressive attitude than both of them, but that doesn't mean you can be aggressive in my chat. That's just how I show. That's just how I express myself. There's a difference between expressing yourself angrily and just insulting people constantly. And they're borderline insulting, if that makes sense. I don't know, it's... Hmm. Again, I only have 22 followers. If this is already something you gotta deal with, then... I want to say this now rather than later, when everyone thinks it's okay to do things like they do. Because yeah, no, if you are going to insult my favorite characters, I'm going to tell you that I don't like that. And if you're like, oh, don't be like that, well fuck you, this is my stream. If you're going to be like, oh, well I guess that's my cue to leave, then leave. Like, again, no one is forcing you to stay here. No one is telling you that you've got to be here. So if you do feel uncomfortable, like obviously tell me that you feel uncomfortable, but don't expect me to apologize. See here, yeah, no, that's I actually like that. Because you made a joke about this is war about Ida. You weren't you weren't going like, wow, you're stupid for doing that. Oh wow, really? Urok is your favorite? We're gonna have problems. Or oh wow. Blah, blah 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 You like Monoma? He has a, such a punchable face. Like, when I offended your character, you're like, alright, this is more, haha. You, weren't like, you didn't throw an insult. You didn't throw, like, a backhanded compliment or something. You just... You know, there's a difference in aggression. Again, aggression like, haha, this is war. Or aggression like, haha, he has a punchable face, I don't like Uraka. Like, okay. And... I don't know, I just feel like, oh, Nightbot, perfect! I literally have Nightbot here doing this every 20 minutes, telling people that I might touch on topics that they might not like. I might do things that they might not like. And it's just... If you're really gonna stay in my chat and act the way Ghost was acting... You've been warned. I'm not gonna sugarcoat things for you. I'm not gonna apologize because you're uncomfortable on my stream. You didn't have to watch me. So yeah, I just I just needed to get that out there because real sh uh, I know I probably shouldn't say this, but they're the reason why I left Six's server as a mod. Just because Six loved them to bits, but they run things in a more apologetic, even if they're wrong, you should try to keep the peace with them. I can't do that, and as a mod, I definitely cannot do that. So it's just that that's Six's server. That's Six. That's the way Six wants things to be done. So I respect that for them. But on my platform, I can't do that, and I don't want people to think because I'm so involved with someone else's platform that I will act like them. That I will do things with them. That's what I was like before my friends stepped over me and made me delete my server. Yeah, I I it, I remember you said something about a Discord server on Periscape's stream, um, but I was like, oh. but yeah, I know, like, you can't let people do shit, and 
again, out of privacy for Styx and Ghost, I'm not going to say what they did. It really isn't that bad. They just wouldn't own up to everything they did wrong. And it's just... In, in the most indirect way possible, you cannot tell someone to let something go if they haven't even replied to you yet. If they've only replied to you once, because they just picked it up. You can't be like, let it go already if they they just touched on it. So yeah, um... I really don't care if I sound aggressive and this got people to leave my stream. Um, I'd rather people know this about me now than later, because again... You, you get what you get. You're not, I'm not gonna be like, oh, super soft, I'm encouraging everyone, and then like, two years down the line, completely change my brand. Like, no. You're gonna get aggressive, potentially suicidal thoughts, and that's what, that's what I'm always gonna bring to you. Oh wow, that sounds a lot, a lot, a lot worse in my head. <laughs> ah. But yeah, we spent about, uh... Aw, uh, thank you. Yeah, um, <laughs> I have no problem with you if, like, that's something going on, on in your head. Like, we actually kind of talk outside of streams and Discord servers. We have that Twitter thing. And it's just like, you know, people who actually try to reach out to me and know me, like Paula. Like, Paula and I kind of talk on and off. Um, that's fine. But again, Ghost, we only ever talked in my friend's chat, in my friend's servers. And it's just... Ugh. But yeah, because we spent so much time on this, um, I am going to head on to Minecraft now because I have an entire row full of copper and I don't know what to use it on because I just, I don't like using, I got hiccups, excuse me. Hmm. Um, I've got an entire row of copper and I don't know what to use it on. So I've been messing around with it on <laughs> on a creative world. I was thinking maybe doing a farm, but then it's just like um, I don't know. I don't really like I don't really like the design I'm going for because I used to have this one, which it was andesite and um, warped ward, which I kind of like because you know the green and blue, uh, green and blue, <laughs> the the blue and yellow contrast. But I feel like this isn't really it. I might do something like covering up the water instead. Like, um, instead of having it on the side, I do this. Uh, like something like that, maybe? I don't know. Because I just, I just don't want to have a shit ton of copper and then never use it. And it's kind of like the new... I keep saying they're the new blocks, they're not new, they've been here since 1.8. Um, the Anasite, Granite, and Diorite, I just, I want to be able to use them in buildings. But I don't know... How? Oh really, you like this? I don't know, it, it was like an old design that I had, but um... I guess when it oxidizes, the green on green, green on blue contrast would be cool, but uh... Uh, right now, I don't really know. I... Because, like, I've used, like, green blocks before. I've used, um... Here. I had this little... <laughs> okay, I'll let me... <laughs> okay, um... This might get be a little controversial, but I actually don't watch, um, any of the GMS SMP members. So, like, I do, kn I do know what DNF is, but, like, um... <laughs> I, I really don't know anything about them, so I do apologize. <laughs> I know, um... Uh, who was it? Who was it? I, I, was, I was telling someone on Instagram that I didn't watch, uh... Uh, GMSMP, and they were so shocked and tried to get me into the lore, and it's like... I appreciate you, but also... I don't have any time to be obsessed in anything else. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know, like, I can use, like, green and blue blocks, it's just, I don't know how to incorporate copper. And, okay, I'm actually proud of this side. So this is, like, an above-ground enchanting table, like, if I were to make an enchanted forest kind of vibe. But if you want to go into the underground, I really like this one more. Because, um, I use... This is too loud for me. Why is that so loud? Hold on. Um, 
I really like this one more because it's like a little tunnel system and then we get into this little room for books and like yeah I'm using the warped ward but I don't really like the copper look which is why um, you're a really good builder also that reminds me I never showed you my mushroom house uh, you built you built this in a week oh no this is my uh, creative world um, so technically speaking I built this in a day but um yeah no this is just creative building right now uh, yeah, I know. Wait. Was that you or someone else? Because... I remember the reason why I joined Mushy's server was because people wanted to show off the buildings. I'm not sure if you were a part of it, though. But yeah, hey, Max. What's up? <laughs> but yeah, so we have um, a bunch of warp wood. Uh, I can never remember the name of this shit. Calcite. And, um, a fully functioning enchanting table, and I just think this is really pretty. This is something I would want to build, um, on my survival thing, but I am gonna need to find all shit ton of shields. <laughs> yeah, I'm doing streaky streams, um, this entire week from Monday to Friday just because... Oh wait, you weren't here for the last few streams! Okay, so basically I've been getting a shit ton of tarot readers, readers. <laughs> a shit ton of tarot readings, which are like... You have to stay inside, you can't go out. Let other things come to you, not you go to them. And it's just like... I don't want to get... I don't want to get sent to the hospital again, so I'm staying inside. But also, another half of tarot readings are being like, You need to focus on your career, you need to really put that into overdrive. So it's like, if I have to stay inside, and if I'm being told to work on my career, well, I have to be inside to stream, so... I thought I might as well try doing an entire week of streaming, see if I can actually do that, and I mean, 22 followers now, I think that's a pretty good start. <laughs> but yeah, um, there's also my windmill, which I use again, the warped wood. I can incorporate green and blue blocks into my thing, I just really don't like hopper. <laughs> actually, maybe, maybe I can change the stone brick to oxidized copper? Or is that too much green? Because I also have the um, soul lanterns, so maybe, maybe. I also have this random win um, water wheel. I don't know why. There's nothing inside of it. I just really wanted a water wheel. <laughs> I might turn this into like a chess room or something. The windmill blocks racist. Wait, what? What do you mean it's racist? <laughs> it looks racist. <laughs> oh! Max. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Um, the reason why I'm not on Mush's server anymore was just because I needed a little detox. Um, there were a lot of servers that I wasn't really on, or servers that I would literally just pop in to say hi that I'm alive. And that was kind of like Mushy's server. Um, I really only popped in to say, hey, I'm still alive, and... If I'm being honest, um, aside from you, Periscape, and the others who I have the Twitter chat with, um... I didn't really talk to anyone else, so it's just like, if I if I really did want to talk to you guys, I would just go to Twitter, you know? But, uh, I do appreciate Mushy for, you know, uh, streaming and letting me, under letting me what? Letting me, uh, find you guys, but it's just, eh, you know, not my vibe, really. Especially, um, nope, nope, my thought is gone. Oh well. But maybe this would work or is this too much? Um, I feel like this might be a too much...
Okay, let me let me uh, I have the water cup. I don't know, does this look too much? Is should I should I just abandon this? This is also like it's not gonna oxidize that fast because of um the placement. Because if you didn't know, a copper oxidizes faster when it's four by four away from each other. And it's just I'm too impatient to do that, so we're, this is what we're working with. I, don't, I feel like it's a little too much. And like some parts I can't even cover. Just what if? What if I? What if I did this? Ooh, I can't. Ooh, wait, I actually kind of like that. And then that. And then put water here. No. That then mean I need to put <laughs> mm. might be a little too much. Um yeah, we're gonna we're we're gonna come back to that another time. Cause like from far away it looks good, but then you go up and then you just get this. I don't know. Eh. Right. It does, it does not look good. Oh well. Uh, hmm. Something I can try is... Mm, building a mining room? Because, like, <laughs> why do we do uh, pillars like this and then having chests there? I mean, it's pretty irrelevant because, like, there's so many fucking ravines and mine shafts on uh, the survival thing. But what if we did something like this and then. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, copper. Copper, copper. What else can I do? Not much. On By the way, Max, if you're still on stream, uh, how's work been? Cause I don't know. The first thing I wrote, blah 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 blah, blah words. Uh, I remember you were on your staycation, and then now you're working all the time, and it's just. That sounds like a big, uh, 180. This isn't gonna look good, is it? No. Hmm, no. But, let's try it out anyways. Yes, you can go here. Do do. Uh, ooh, we can do this, actually. We need a platform. And how high is this? One, two, three, four. One more should do it. Um. Oh, it's a bit high outside, but you're surviving. And then investigation when you start streaming, right? <laughs> I'm also really glad that you did come to those first streams because I know I wanted to like do it on my own and stuff, but uh, it was nice having someone around. Uh, also, did I show you my mushroom house on the server? I I think you might have, but uh, if I'm being completely honest, I don't remember if you did. I mean, personally for me, I know it's annoying to join a shit ton of servers, but if you do want, um, I do have my own Discord server. It has a lot of verification things, but uh, hey, if you want it, it's there. Uh, two, five, one, two, face that. Okay. 
I'm going blind. <laughs> oh, I can. Oh, that's so much easier. Jesus. That is so much easier. Jesus Christ. Okay. Alright, we're getting somewhere. Still don't know if I like the pillars. I really hope they do end up oxidizing because I want to see why it looks like green. I might just have to replace it though. But that's looking good. Uh, hmm. What would good go with... What would good, what would good go <laughs> What would look good with green? Birch? Uh, good to have people when... Publishing your first stream, eh? Yeah. I mean, um... I did want to practice talking to myself that first stream, but, uh... <laughs> it was fun having you there. <laughs> okay, so... If that's gonna be the pillars, let's try birch, birch, birch. Birch... Can't spell... I really can't spell... Okay. We're not, we're not going to try to finish that. Um, what else would look good with green? Green... Stone? Stone brick? Maybe? Stone brick, stone brick. Not there. Hmm. When you do it like that, it's gonna look... Mm, let's try the bricks. Oh, whoops. And then stone brick here, perhaps? Um... Hmm. Apologies if I go really quiet in this stream. I just, I really want to figure out how to use copper in my build because it looks good for other people. It just doesn't look good for me. You like that? And have the back be. No. Back be birch? I'm sorry, I zoned out. Um, what was that message? Also, I could join the server. I left one today. Oh, sure. Um, do do. Here is the link if you would like. Um, it does have a verification thing because um, we've had people uh post post very special photos. So uh, there is a verification thing, and then we do have roles based on levels, just because. I, I refuse to allow new people to post photos just because uh, I don't want to see that again. <laughs> like, I mean, I'm glad it happened because now my server is like pretty secure in terms of how my other servers I'm on are. But uh, I thought it had it happened is. <laughs> And um, once you get to the rules section, we do have a certain version of the rules. You don't have to read the entire uh, fucking contract looking thing because I know not everyone has the time to read it. Um, I'm just a little neurotic and I want to make sure people can't fuck me over. <laughs> wow. 
What if I did something like this? Uh, hmm, 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 hmm. Yeah, people really just want to see the world born. Um, I just saw a video from my friend on TikTok of a dog leash in the. Why is there a dog leash in the fridge? What? That okay? In the fridge? I guess that makes. I guess that would make the neck old when. No, no, I don't, I don't understand. <laughs> uh, I kind of like the look of this. Maybe if I add stairs? Potentially. Potentially. Then, what if I, instead of that, I did this? For the lanterns. And... I feel like that would be too much green, so let's use regular lanterns. If I can spell it. Okay, with a hoe. Or is that too low? Should I make that high? I might make this higher. So that would be three up, okay. Uh, one, two, three. We're gonna have a lot of chests for this thing. Jesus. Uh, lanterns, lanterns. What we could do is round out the ceiling, but I don't think. Hmm. Stone brick stairs. Do this, and then take you guys out. That not too far back. Mm, actually, not not the worst. Let's. What if we bring this up though? Then do this. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Or should that be stone brick at the very back? Like, I kind of like the contrast. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna keep it like this. Um, so uh, it's inside the rules, so you do have to scroll through it, which is it gets people to actually read the rules. And inside there, there should be an emoji, and all you gotta do is click on it. Um. Yeah, I kind of like the look of this, Max. Um, but should I do... Okay. I am able to reach this, but if I put another set of chests up here, would I be able to reach that? Would I be able to... I would be! Okay! So we can have like a shit ton of chests here. Alright, alright. I, I can vibe with this. I guess then... We can repeat the pattern without it looking disgusting. Uh... Oh, I did it that because I read the rules, the smaller version. Okay, I'm in the being stupid because I just realized the emoji. <laughs> um, um, do you have Instagram? Because I do, I do understand that it is hard for some people, and that's not being like, oh, it's gonna be hard for everyone. Um, some of my really smart like academic friends have had trouble getting onto my server. So if you have Instagram, I do have a story highlight that shows you. Um, a little tour, how to get around it, um, what certain things mean. Um, if you ever need that, it's there for you. Of course, you do need Instagram, because for some reason, uh, Instagram's just stupid like that. 
And what if I outline? Yeah, um, so in the general category, uh, pinned should be a message, and in that message should be a link to my Instagram. There, you should see just like a little rundown in case like anything confuses you. I actually kind of really like this. Oh no, didn't mean to do that. Eat, get out, get get out. <laughs> but then would I do it like that? Mm, no. Like that. Okay. Um At one point, um there was an entire fortification category just for itself and the message in that category was click on the emoji. You do not under you do not realize how many people would still ask me, "What do I do?" It was written in Portuguese and uh Portuguese and English saying click the emoji, but um, I would get so many comments from new people asking me how to do it. <laughs> ah, the good old days. Hmm. Now, do I do that like that? Or is that too much birch? Um, I'll do this side and you guys tell me what you think. That might be... Uh, I don't, I don't too much. Ooh, something that we can do is for the boba elevator, we can make that proper, you know, get rid of, get rid of our entire supply, because I, I don't think this is going to take us out. That, uh, hmm. What if I added another layer? What if I went ahead, broke this? Hmm. Uh, or we do it like this. That here. No. That here. Hmm. Okay. 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 And then this. Okay. I'm. I vibe with this. And then potentially do this. Or is that, or is that too much? Oh, 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 what I can do is this. I fucking love this design. Okay. Eat. Like that, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, what if I, mm, no, can't, I can't do it with this one. All right. Like that. And then Verge on top. Oh, yeah, I like that. I like that a lot. <laughs> but then would I want to bring it down one? Hmm. Hmm, I know. Because something that I've been told I need to work on is my uh, asymmetry because I really like um, doing it by fives and threes and having it look the same but uh I really want I really want to do the bottom part but I know that um, not everything has to be symmetrical <laughs> what if I actually did this no not this this not that, this. What, what if I... Mm. Yay or nay? Is it going to be a house or just an area with chest? Um, I think this is just me an area with chest just because if I ended up turning this into a house, that would be a huge ass build. Um, I don't know. Do you guys like the extra um, copper or do you like the minimal copper? I'm, I'm, I'm leaning towards the minimal. What if, what if I, what if I, eh? 
Uh, mm, no. What if it's this, though? Uh, no. Oh, well, what about this? Okay. I, I like that. <laughs> Uh, no, it's the other way, other way. Like that, and then that. And we'll... Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and then what we can do... <laughs> Because this would show is make that a wall instead. So to do, do let's do this. Then just wall it off. Wall it off, yeah. Uh do do do. Like that. Um, hmm. What if I stone brick it? Like that and then turn uh i don't understand the parade one so the parade is kind of a creator thing it's something that's like oh, how do i how do i explain the parade the parade is for everyone it's if you have something you want to share in terms of creator creation uh you can post it there so a lot of my friends are on TikTok and or Twitch, so if they ever want to uh, post a TikTok, they can, and they can tag people to then um, not like the video, but to go check it out and like, you know, if they do end up liking it, um, give them some reach. And uh, for the ones on Twitch, I have something called Dreambot, I call him a Leviathan though, who do do, hmm, hmm. Uh, Leviathan, he allows you to add people to it for when they go live, and anytime they do, you will get a going live notification from them. But because we had an issue with someone uh, spamming the parade category with TikToks every single day, we changed it so that uh, he, there's different ones. So there's the... Um, already then, back to work. Bye! Thanks for coming out, uh, Max. <laughs> So we have uh, we have the announcement parade. Um, if it if it makes any more sense, just remove parade and say ping or alert because that's basically what it is. Um, so we have the announcement parade. So if you only want to be pinged when there's an announcement, uh, there's that. When you want to be pinged for when I do something, there's the torrent parade for uh, me specific content. If you want to be pinged when other people in the server do something cool. Uh, that's when the Hype Parade comes in, because anyone can use the Hype Parade. Uh, Stream Parade is for anyone who wants to stream or is streaming. Uh, poll Parade is just when I have a poll that I need answered and people want to answer them. <laughs> um, because something I noticed that I really hate about some people's servers is when they, have, uh, they don't have any specific ping and it's just at everyone all the time. And although I end up muting servers so it doesn't bug me, I know it bugs a lot of other people. And so for that, I um, I made sure that you would only be pinged when you wanted to be pinged. So my laptop's about to die, so let me just plug this in real quick. <laughs> but yeah, if you ever like have a Instagram photo that you really adore or... Um, this doesn't look good. Or like a TikTok that you really want people to watch. You can tag the Hype Parade and anyone who wants to watch it will be able to. This. Because uh, although it is um my server, I do appreciate other people. I do like when other people are able to show their passion because I know a lot of people are like, oh, it's my server, I'm going to make sure that, uh... Uh, also, I was in another server with the same issue with the not safe for work stuff, they gave it two weeks before you can get rows. 
Ooh. Yeah, no, um... I... I've updated my server quite a bit. I've tested a lot of things out. Um... I find it that the people who want to post not super for work things, um, they're gonna do it as soon as they can, so... What I do is, I don't give people the permission to post their own photos until they are active on my server. Because along with being active on my server, that then also shows your character. Because if you can't go a day without doing something that breaks the rules, then we already know who you are. But if you can do things and send enough messages to then get uh, to level 5, you will be able to send photos as much as you please. But yeah, I know some people, their, um, their Discord servers are just for them and it's only going to be... Um, their content and they actually don't talk in it, it's just, you know, to update you when they're doing something. Other people have a huge ass server that is social, it has everything. You don't even remember that it's for them and that's how my server used to be like and I didn't really like that so I changed it. And then um, you have other people's server which is like, it's not dead but it's not active either. Um, they don't have specific channels just to hang out in but they also have more than just, hey, I'm live now, and I fucked this up again. <laughs> Sometimes that's the only reason why they join the server, and that's why they give it two weeks. Yeah, yeah. That's exactly why um I refuse to um. Do allow people to do photos. I used to not allow people to send gifts until level five either, but then we realized that's a little that's a little bullshit. I can't believe I fucked this up. How did I? Uh... <laughs> All right, do this for Q. One, two. Do, 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 do. Uh, they also had an issue with a bunch of people seeing stuff in the introduction, even though saying, even sending a graphic gift because my friend to go that caused my friend to go into baby mode. Uh, they have uh dissociative identity disorder. Ooh. Yeah. Um. With my introductions, I do um, appreciate when people send gifts, just so like people kind of get your vibe. But if they're sending graphic gifts, that's... Ew, yeah, that's yikes. Break. All of this. Do, 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 do. Uh, that's the only way you got into the server by... Oh! I have a- I have a friend who's like that, except for, um, they actually couldn't figure out how to automate it, and they didn't want to- <laughs> They didn't want to have to check everyone's, like, introductions first, so they- They gave up right away, um... I don't know, I've don't- I don't feel like people should have to do introductions, um... For, on my server, actually, it was requested that I make an introduction channel because with me, I'm someone who you the you just gotta break the ice. You shouldn't have to be like, "Hey, this is me. Uh, this is what I like to do." Uh, friends, I feel like you should just be like, "Yo, what's up?" The the start talking to people, but I know not everyone can be like that. So it's just I don't. know, My philosophy is not for everyone, and I do understand when people uh, need the little push. Um, but yeah, I don't know. Introductions being the only way to get onto the server. Hmm. 
I mean to destroy that fuck. Oh, that worked out though. Like that, maybe? Okay, I don't... Mm. I actually liked it a lot more when this was only too wide. Fuck. Okay, let's just... <laughs> let's just pretend that doesn't exist then. And... This side again. You know what? A big part of building is learning what you don't like. And that's fine by me. Yeah, I'm in a lot of servers that have different rules. And I, I really can't do servers and group chats. Um, That's why uh, when I was making all those jokes with you guys on Mushy Server, I was like, hey, do you guys actually want the, uh, the Twitter thing? Because like, like I'll, I'll talk in them if other people talk, but it's just like, I, yeah, you know? <laughs> I don't know, I... I feel like it's a lot less personal in uh, group chat, so it's just, it, I like to get to know people without, uh, no, no, I lost my train of thought, I don't know what I was going to say. Uh, you keep forgetting to do it because you. <laughs> uh, yeah. Um, I have this huge habit of saying that I'm going to reply to someone, and I just completely forget because in my head I already did. Because people who can send a message right away without thinking it over are very interesting to me. Like I can send a message as soon as I get it, but I do have like a thought process behind it. Some people will send literal paragraphs, and then when asked about it, be like, oh, yeah, whatever. It's just like, what do you mean? That is not whatever. Like, you, they don't even... People who don't think ahead are interesting to me. Uh, hmm. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> then it was. Ooh, I can't do that. What if I do it like this? But. Uh, there, this, that, okay, okay, um, oh, I'm the same sometimes, I don't think, I could send the mushroom house in the group chat because I can't send in your cert, yeah, you gotta wait until you're level 5 for either that, but, um, if you wanna send it in the, uh, other chat, then, uh, feel free to do it. How did I, how, how does this, it lines up, okay. And then, oh, okay, got it, got it. And then, how am I going to do the rest of this? I might just have to uh, use fences for this part. Yeah. And then, like this. Yeah. All right. Unless we do it like this. And then, no, no. This works better. Oh, and if you ever want um, to know more about your roles, there is a Display Roles channel that, uh, as the, as, the, as the name suggests, uh, will tell you what your display role means. Mm. Go across, go across, yeah. 
Oh, what about one across? Ooh, that'd be something. <laughs> okay, okay. I'm vibing. Now let's do this, like that. And then a uh, fence. Fence gate? I like the look of gates. Okay. Um, gate, gate, gate. This might look good with warped planks once it starts to oxidize. Let's, uh, go. So send. So send. Help. Water. Boom, 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 boom. Do that like that. Uh, let's water up here. Help. Perfect. Take this off. Ooh, ooh, no. <laughs> That off. But yeah, I deserve that. And then change this with no sand. Uh do you have any anime recognitions? Because I'm trying to get my friend into more anime. Um I feel like for starter anime, uh hmm. Oh, sorry, I completely missed your other message too. Um I quickly looked at it for a moment because I didn't want to miss any more of your live stream. Oh, <laughs> dude, you don't have to. Oh, that's sweet. But yeah, um, don't be afraid to miss um the live stream, especially this one because like, <laughs> I'm just breaking blocks the entire time. But in terms of anime recommendations, I would say um, we were talking about it last uh, yesterday too. I would say Orin Host Club because it's just. It's a casual, I've been in just chatting this entire time. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, uh, okay. <laughs> oh. Uh, me and my friend are watching Orange Host Club, but I have to wait. Uh, to be my favorite character. Wait. But um, yeah, I feel like Orange's a pretty good one because it it introduces you to Reverse Harlem's. It introduces you to um stereotypes and um. The unfortunate but very clear um, family princess incest thing that happens in a few shows. Uh, it's a good starter anime because it gives you both the lighthearted things and the darker things and the little out there things. Um, another one is. Haikyuu is a good one, but I wouldn't say it's a starter one just because the first season is kind of slow. But, uh, if they like sports, uh, IQ is also another one that I would recommend. <laughs> uh, my friend started taking out the glasses and she's not trope. Taking out the glasses? Oh, like taking off Haruhi's glasses? And she doesn't like, and she's... Hot trope. Oh, 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 got it, got it. So if they don't like that, um, I mean, yeah, sports animes, um, there's no, there's little to no chicks, so you won't have that issue. <laughs> uh, 
how about uh Jujutsu Kaisen is not a starter anime, but it's a pretty good starter dark fantasy anime, if that makes sense. Um, because like, actually no, no, it wouldn't be a good starter one because it gets your hopes up for female characters. <laughs> uh, Attack on Titan, perhaps? Because there's no sexualization, but there is a little fan service every now and then. Uh, but like they like anime so far and they really like the main character because I feel like it's a non-binary character. If you like non-binary characters, um, there is a one season uh, tennis anime called Stars of Line. It has a, uh, a non-binary... I don't think he's the lead. I actually haven't watched it, but my friend kept recommending it to me. Uh... I don't know. <laughs> oh, uh, Soul Eater. A lot of people say that's non-binary coded, especially with um, Corona. Uh, but I really don't like Death the Kid. So if people get on their nerves a lot, um, I would not recommend it because Death the Kid. He, mm, I don't, I don't like him. <laughs> I don't. Then a block. Break this. Do it like that. Oh, this. Oh, I fucked it up. Oh no. Wait. No, I didn't. Wait, what? How did. Okay. Want. Break this. And put this here. And then I could put the little lantern on it like that. Then, eventually, we can. This, break that, put that there, break that, put that there, boom, hmm, hmm, how about, how about, how about this, this, a little too much, not enough, um, we also put Attack on Titan on the list, but I also don't, I also want to get them into Sailor Moon, oh my god, yeah, um, Sailor Moon Crystal does a really good job of sticking to the manga. So, uh... Although I do like the 90s Sailor Moon, um... Sailor Moon Crystal does so much justice to it. Especially, um, if you end up doing the dub. I know Viz redubbed the 4Kids one, but, uh... The new uh, Cinnamon Crystal English stuff is also really fucking good too. There's no kissing cousins. Uh, we might watch both the 90s version. Uh, we just uh, have to find one that's not censored. Yeah, yeah, you have to find the Viz one. Uh, v I Z. Because that's the one that actually um, kept the Japanese translations, not for kids. But, do do do, why did. Okay, that's weird. Um, hmm. I feel like. Yeah, I feel like I could incorporate copper into like a huge chest room. I might make this underground. That way, like, if you ever have to go mining for something, I could just like drop down, have a shit ton of chest full of cobblestone, and just go mining shit ahead and sideways. Um, maybe, potentially. Yeah, I like that idea. Um, I might work on this on another stream, but yeah, I can fuck with this. Uh, let's try the oxidized copper though, because that's what we're eventually going to get. Um, how would that look? Because we can always put beeswax on it and then make it stay this color forever, but what if, what happens when I do that? It gets a 10 times better when I do that. Okay, I like this. I like this a lot. Uh, 
Uh, but the website we're using has 90s version that's homophobic. Mm. Uh, off stream, I will look into uh, seeing if I can send you a link because my friend, uh, was it was it 2018 or 2019? They were watching the Viz dub, and I, I'll I'll see if I I can see other blah, blah 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 blah. I'll see if I can ask them where they watched it because it was not legal what they did. So let's uh do this and I really like yeah so once it eventually oxidizes it's gonna look something like that um actually let's do it on this side just because there's more it's it's the, it's the side that I built most on <laughs> boom, boom 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 let's do this 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 boop this. Yeah, and then I was right. That would have been too much green if I had. Um, well, let's see. So, did that happen too much? Let's uh, do this pillar too. So if I did that and then put the lanterns here. It's also a lot darker, okay, so that we will abandon, but I, I like this, I like this a lot. <laughs> um, but the website also has a second reason, had the vid for some reason. Um, huh. Yeah, that's weird. Um. So the first fees so the first season is for kids, but then the second season is is Fizz. That's odd. Wait, was I not yeah no it's this do, do, do. That Yeah, I like this. I so we're gonna have to build with the regular copper, but then it's gonna gradually fade into the other copper. Hopefully. I don't know, I've never seen it fade in a build very fast. I, it always has to be like a whole week later or something. Oh no. Oh no. I I fucked up. What about elevator? There we go. But yeah, I can fuck with this. Uh, but the we have two second season. I do not understand. <laughs> hmm. But yeah, definitely. Um, off stream, I will work on this a little more, just because. Uh. How cool would it be to have a huge underground mining system? Um, that's what I usually do, but... I mean, in, in our survival world, it doesn't really matter because, uh... This is, there's a lot of ravines. A lot of them. So it's just, um... Yeah, I don't know. And also, that might be a nice chest system to have before, um, this one. <laughs> because this one requires a lot of granite and, um... A lot of andesite. I have been starting to mix it around with uh, stone bricks to give it texture, but uh, it's gonna require a lot. <laughs> oh, and just because um, I don't want to spend a lot of time on building a house, this is going to be the house that we build uh, on the ser on the not server on the solo world, just because it's nice, it's quiet, it's. I don't need much because I'm playing in vanilla. I don't have a uh, a need for an enchanting tower yet, or like any room for what's it called? What's it called? A brewing stand or anything. So before, hmm, I might have too many chests on the other world. Then yeah, I don't know. 
I just checked the website and now it has fizz. <laughs> I guess it's just- I need to find a cactus. Oh no. <laughs> oh no, my house won't be complete. Um, okay, um. <laughs> oh, but like, that's good, right? That they have fizz? Or am I like misreading everything completely? Uh, yeah, I think that will be all for today. I really wanna. Cause we need a farm. Uh, one day, one day. Oh well. Yeah, because I don't want my friend complaining about the. <laughs> Uh, it's the fact that they don't even fix it. <laughs> it's like, I don't know about you, but I would not take several bullets to the chest for my cousin. <laughs> uh, oh god, they, they really fucked that one up. Like, if anything, they could have done what they did with Story Sight, how they turned Story Sight into a girl, they could have turned Sailor Uranus into a boy. And, um... I don't know, I feel like... I feel like that could have been executed a lot better in terms of censorship. But yeah, I'm just gonna hop off now. <clears throat> uh, Alright. <sighs> My brain is so tired. Um, honestly, for this stream, I mainly was going to um lecture ghosts just because I really don't need that in my chat. But they didn't come, so honestly, I'm also glad for that just because. I didn't, I didn't need to see people whining. So, thank you for the peaceful stream, honestly, like... I don't know, I would rather, um... Nope, don't know where I was going with that, um... It was nice talking to you, too. Oh, another thing on my server is that, um, a lot of people kind of just hop into first chat, just kind of randomly, so if you ever see someone, um... Feel free- to, I would say feel free to say hi, but also, just know, um, I don't know everyone on the server, so I cannot guarantee that, like, they're good people or not. Uh, a lot of people, because of the way I act towards everyone, a lot of people assume that everyone knows me and each other, and a lot of my friends would be like, but you guys have known each other for years. No, dude, I've known this person for like a week. It's um, it's a whole thing where a lot of people think that because it's it's my thing with the introductions again. I don't really like having to break ice. I just like to act as if the ice was never there to begin with. And because of that, a lot of people think I'm like best friends with people, and it's just, but that's not the case. So if anyone tells you that they're my friends, um, well, first of all, all my friends know to not say that they're my friend because I. I have a little issue with commitment. <laughs> but yeah, um, if you ever see anyone in voice chat, uh, Mel tends to go into the Movie Nights channel and just like plays uh, films and stuff. Last week they were doing Brooklyn Nine-Nine, but they don't actually announce it, so it's, it's like a secret Movie Night kind of thing. Um, a lot of the time, me, Elliot, uh, my Elliot, not the one on Russia's stream, and a few of other, of other friends, we do Bedwars, um, I wouldn't say at night, but like, late in the evening. Uh, so if you ever want to hop on, uh, that's always there for you. Uh, what else? Sometimes people just chill in uh, uh, the general channel and listen to music. Um, have you heard the Cupcake remixes on TikTok? Because I fucking love them. And for like, for like two whole hours, me and a few other people were just listening to compilations of... Uh, <laughs> <sighs> Wait, that was the cupcake song? 
Uh, I tried to fart the song like the plague. Uh, okay, like like the artist cupcake, you know. Um, <laughs> I I want to play it, but I'm pretty sure she's DMCA, so I won't. But um, if you're ever in uh, uh, I was in My Little Pony. Oh no, no, we're talking about cupcake, like um, deep throat, vagina, like the the. Is she a rapper? I don't think. Like that that cupcake. Cupcake with two Ks, you know? Oh! Have you really not heard? Join for your chat after stream. I gotta I gotta show you some masterpieces. <laughs> yeah, I was like, there's a cupcake song? I know about the muffin song because um someone kept requesting it in one of my friend's streams and it was it was not what I thought it was gonna be. Um I'm going to be awake at night so I can join Bedwars thing and I almost won my first game. Oh I I didn't realize how often I played Bedwars because um I didn't realize you could check your total statistics. I thought it was just what it was on the side. But I have played over five hundred games of Bedwars. <laughs> Uh, you don't want to go onto the dark side of My Little Pony. Just going to tell you that. Hmm. Yeah, I'm afraid. Because, like, I used to watch My Little Pony as a child, and I still watch a few episodes growing up. And, like, some of the songs are fucking bangers. Like, um, the Equestria Grill series has a lot of fucking great songs. But every time I see someone, who, like, an adult in the fandom, it's just so... Creepy and dark, and it's just yikes. That's why I don't do fandom things. Like, like maybe if like the GM SMP didn't have a whole cult like following, I maybe would watch them. But it's just the whole like there are some things that like you can be a fan of, and that's fine. But there's other things like if you're not part of the fandom, then you get completely ostracized and. I don't. That's kind of what's ha That's kind of what I've seen in like My Little Pony and GMS and P, and the fact that those two things are in the same sentence are very interesting. Um. Uh. But yeah. Uh, if you're ever on, we do have bed wars. Uh. If you ever want to be pinged for Minecraft, Monster Prom, any Steam game, Among Us or anything, in the general gaming category. Pinned is more automated roles. I have Discord closed, so I don't know what you've done yet. So, uh, yeah. I will talk to you in a bit, I guess, if you're down for it. Um, yeah. I'll see you guys tomorrow, where I potentially will build a house and or find a uh, desert. I've, I literally found a ruined portal before I found a new biome, and I hate that. Because I just want... I just want either acacia... Or a desert, but no. Can't get that. <laughs> but yeah, uh... Thank you so much for coming out, uh... Bye!